French Defense, Winnower, Advanced Variation, 4, NE75.3BXC3 plus 6.BXC3B6. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well. White outmaneuvered black in the end game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. While preparing for d5, the French defense prevents the light squared bishop in favor of a strong center and opportunities for counterattacks. The center is fully controlled by d4 and the dark squared bishop is made available. The e4 pawn is threatened by the center counterattack on d5. NC3 defends the e4 pawn and pressures the d5 pawn. BB4 pins the knight on c3, preventing it from moving or protecting e4, and threatens to trade, disrupting white's pawns after bxc3. e5 closes the center and attacks the important d6 and f6 squares. NE7 develops the knight and prepares castling. A3 forces the bishop to decide, exchange or retreat. Bxc3 plus captures the knight and forces white to double their c pawns in exchange for the bishop pair. Bxc3 captures the bishop, supports the d4 pawn and opens up the b file. B6 prepares to develop the light squared bishop to a 6 or b7. It is the last book move. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. By growing a queen from its beginning square, this activates the queen. That's good. Very precise. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. By attacking the enemy knight, this activates a piece while also buying time. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. That's a decent move. That's good. This misses an opportunity to connect rooks. It is an inaccuracy. That's fine. It is good. This is an equal trade. It is best. A better technique to recapture a piece is missed by this. It is incorrect. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a queen. It is a miss. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This kicks the checking queen away with a pawn. It is best. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. This threatens to play checkmate. It is best. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This strikes the opponent's bishop. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. This is an equal trade. It is best. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. It's compelled. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. That's good. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is quite good. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. This threatens to attack a trapped rook. It is best. This poses a material threat. It is incorrect. A rook enters the action after developing outside of its starting square as a result. It is ideal. The pawn is now passed because it can no longer be challenged by opposing pawns as it tries to promote. It is best. This moves the checking pawn farther away. It is ideal. There was just one smart move to be made. It is incorrect. This strikes a rival knight. It is ideal. The knight is thus brought to safety. That's good. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. While not a mistake, 
that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This defends a piece that is being attacked but is not well defended. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. That's good. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The rook is now in a safe position. It is ideal. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This enables the adversary to win a tempo by posing a rook threat. It is incorrect. This wins a tempo by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. It is best. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. As a result, the rooks are placed in a single file and are able to cooperate to pose a danger. It is ideal. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This permits the opponent to pin a knight to the king. It is an inaccuracy. This pins the other side's knight to the king, rendering it immobile. It is ideal. This prevents an attack on a knight who may have been taken prisoner. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. This threatens to fork pieces. This is the start of the end game and black is equal. It is best. This is the only good move. This prevents the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is a great move. That's fine. It is good. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. It is ideal. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is a mistake. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This misses a chance to strengthen a weak pawn's defense. It is incorrect. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is ideal. This places the rook in a passive defensive position. Often it is better to go for active counterplay in the end game, even if it loses a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. White had the advantage at first, but now they are in the lead. It is incorrect. Although white is still in a superior position, they have lost their winning edge. It is incorrect. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well. White outmaneuvered black in the end game.